Hello Linux fans, Rob here and this video is primarily for Windows users and Mac users. I'm going to call this the Many Faces of Gnome or Gnome, take your pick. And really what I want to do is illustrate how much fun you can have with GNU Linux and the desktop primarily and here we're going to use Gnome to illustrate how you can radically change the, the UI as well as the theming and the look which kind of gives you an opportunity to really explore various ways to make the operating system work for you. And I think it's heads and tails above what your options are within Mac and Windows, so that's why I think it's going to be really fun. So stay tuned for some relaxing music with different faces of GNOME uh, that we'll be playing in the background. And again, this will be all on the same operating system with the same desktop environment. Now what I have set up here just to kick it off is I am using the Domodamus icon set here which gives it a nice look because they're not flat menus they're brightly colored and they've got some depth to them and I think they kind of look like I don't know maybe a little bit like Windows but that's okay. Uh, then we have the paper GTK theme in place here for the coloring and the borders and that kind of thing. Overall, it gives it a nice look. Now, if you're a Mac user, you're used to a dock at the bottom. You could configure this in multiple ways, which I'm going to illustrate as we kind of move on with the videos. And then up top here, you've got a quick link to application and places, as well as a drop down here for calendar and weather and things like that. And then here you have access to sound settings, Wi-Fi, so on and so forth. So that's your general UI here. And then we've got the kind of odd but usable uh, taskbar, if you will, here that's default in GNOME. And that can be changed as well. All right, so stay tuned here as the music kicks in and we roll into the various looks or many faces of GNOME. And just remember, this is all the same desktop on the same operating system. We're just using extensions, settings, and themes to totally change the way this looks and feels. Hope you have fun with this.
Well, Linux fans, that's just a few examples of how you can radically change the look and UI of the GNOME desktop. So Windows users and Mac users, eat your heart out. The new Linux users have a blast customizing things. I hope you had as much fun watching this as I had making it. And as always, thanks for watching.